Okay, ladies and gentlemen, one research reactor, 25 generators, roughly. Uh, I don't want to count them again. Everybody else, y'all can count them if you want. <sighs> That's why, because I'm really tired. I gotta go someplace and I'm coming home and go to bed. Anyway, uh, got the research reactor. I was just gonna go idle it, but I think I'm just gonna quit the game for right now. Um, I've got. Alright, that's why everything's starting to calm down. It's because I'm not pulling in and uh, putting in any more radiation. So I got um, 1800 coming out. Um, with the water flow restricted. If you uh, restrict the water flow uh, to your reactor. It will make it unhappy. Yes, you want it to be unhappy, but not too unhappy, because we all know what happens. Let's see here, what's the water level being restricted to? 1508. And, as an extra boost, I know it's a dev generator, but, you know, surely just for entertain my entertainment, work, I got uranium. And usually I set that to two, two, gra uh, two grams a second. That feeds into the reactor and things happen. Also, I get a bunch of nuclear fallout down here, which is pulled and filtered out and vented out to space. So, I'm just giving you all a uh, heads up. This is uh, Toast Webbs, the mad scientist of nuclear reactors, saying peace out. Uh, the challenge is, my challenge anyway, at some point in the future, I'd like to get that way, that bar as far up the ladder as possible, far up the reactor as possible without popping it. <coughs> Which means possibly I could run more generators on it in theory, but just want to give y'all a heads up, and that's what I got going on. And uh, yeah, so peace out, Tozer Webs.